seeking English IELTS general practice test uh, one reading passage one questions one through seven uh, it says uh, you want to mark a if you can do it on the ground floor B if you can do it on the second floor C if you can do it on the third floor D if you can do this on the fourth floor this is pretty transparent um, uh, so that the thing the things that you have to identify are where to have lunch where to cash a check where to buy stamps where to get permission to enter the building where to buy a newspaper uh, where to buy pens for your office and where to find the location of any office in the building I can tell you the the order is not completely transparent in this one um, don't worry it's a pretty short passage if you're careful uh, you won't have to move around won't have to move up and down too much it says Barchester office towers visitor information Welcome to Barchester Office Towers. All areas beyond the ground floor lobby are off limits to visitors without a pass. Please obtain, uh, please, excuse me, please approach the security desk near the back of the lobby to obtain your pass. Okay, you must present a photo ID. The security officer on duty will direct you to the office you are visiting. In addition, a building directory and map are located near the security desk. So this, this first paragraph actually answer, uh, answers two of these. It seems to enter, um, these two things are going to be on the same floor, on the ground floor. You're get permission to enter the building. Okay. That's A. Let's put A there. Okay. The other one was find the location of any office in the building. So the security guard will direct you to your office. So that's implicit. Uh, if there's anything to contradict that, we'll, I guess we'll see it later. In the meantime, I would suggest marking it, hoping you won't have to come back. Okay. To reach the rooftop parking area, take the elevator to the fourth floor and then follow the signs. Also located on that floor is City View Bistro serving three meals a day, three meals daily. Okay, so that's in, in English, British English, that's going to be probably breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, so it, it's saying that you could have lunch on the, on the fourth floor. Is that correct? To the fourth floor. That's an option. I would mark that and hope that you won't have to come back. So, fourth floor, letter D. Please have lunch. Okay? Letter D. Continue. Barchester Office Towers offers a number of business services for the convenience of tenants and visitors. The copy center is located on the second floor. Photocopy and tax, sorry, Fax, photocopy and fax services are available here, and you can also purchase basic office and computer supplies. So that's that's in the middle of the paragraph, but that's uh, that mentions office supplies. That was, uh, which floor was that? The second floor. It says, are, are stamps office supplies? They're, they're not. Pens would be office supplies. So number six is going to be the second floor. Continuing from the middle of that same paragraph. Uh, a small branch post office is located down the hall from the copy center. It's down the hall. D down doesn't necessarily mean in English. Uh, down, it could mean uh, in it. <laughs> uh, it could mean south on the map, or it could mean descending number of office numbers. It, uh, it's, it's used in a bunch of ways. Um, down, down the hall. The hall is going to be on the same floor, so it's the same floor as these other things mentioned. Mail pickup is twice a day at 7 a.m. and 5 o'clock p.m. Okay, uh, and that is uh, that is probably where you would buy the stamps. So stamps is yeah, buy stamps number three, and that was I believe on the second floor also, correct? I'm just going to double check it because yeah, same floor, second floor. B is buy stamps. So you have two things left: cash a check, and buy a newspaper. And there's uh, <laughs> there's not much of this of this uh, text left. So <laughs> you must be pretty close. Mail pick. Okay, it says on the on the floor on the floor above, meaning the floor above the second floor. That would be the third floor. Okay. You will find a branch of the National Bank where all banking services are offered. And again, you only have a tiny bit of text left, so it's unlikely that anything is going to con contradict your inference. 
uh, that that is where to do all your banking. I was on the, the floor above the second floor, making up the third floor. So third floor is to cash a check. Excuse me, I forgot. Yeah. And the only thing left is buy a newspaper. And that's probably going to be contained in this last short paragraph. The Barchester Cafe is located next to the National Bank. Here you can enjoy coffee, tea, and home-baked snacks. Most of the uh, major daily papers, as well as business journals and magazines, are on sale at the cafe. So buying a newspaper at the cafe, uh, it, it might not seem obvious to you, but that's what, it, what's, what's suggested here. And that is next to the bank. So it's on the same floor as the bank, which is the third floor because it's the floor above the second. Third floor. C. Okay. Did we miss anything? I don't think so. We have an A, a B, a C, and a D. If there were not one of these, that would be strange. It's not impossible, so I wouldn't blame you for finding it suspicious if something were left out. But you will see uh, other parts of either of, of practice tests or the simulator or the real test where they, they give you something that, that just isn't useful. Uh, so don't, don't be shocked if it happens. It does happen. In this case, all, all four floors uh, were, were mentioned. Okay.